we're going to be turning this Dollar Tree vase and an LED puck light from Amazon into a work of art. Inside of the vase we have a football that has been cut in half and a quarter inch PVC pipe has, has been stuck down in the center and glued in just so we can be able to turn and paint at the same time. We're going to put a coat of white on this thing and then we're going to let it dry, hit it with a coat of black and then it's going to be an amazing burn. Alright guys, we got our face out on the stick. We're going to hit it with a coat of Rust-Oleum Gloss White. We're not really worried about the bottom, the bottom of it. There's nice even coats. Not really even. Just getting it done, really. Make sure we cover all the spots where we turn and missed it a little bit. We're not worried about the bottom. All right. There we go. Got a nice coat of white on that vase. We're gonna let it dry, and then we're gonna hit it with a coat of black. Y'all stick around, it's gonna be an amazing base. And I know you're thinking, that's a circle. Y'all just wait. All right guys, that coat is dry. As you can tell, it's kinda hard, kinda difficult. Spray painting and holding at the same time. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put a coat of black rust gloss paint on it, and then we'll be back. All right guys, we're back. We just finished putting that Rust-Oleum gloss black paint on there. One coat of white Rust-Oleum gloss paint. So that's all we did right there. We're gonna let it dry. Then we're gonna start this amazing burn. All right guys, this is the image that we're gonna be doing today. But before we get into that, check out this. I know you asked yourself, how am I going to engrave on a vase? Here's the answer. The Y-axis rotary rollers and this is my custom made stand made by my brother Anthony if y'all out there close to Florida Tampa Florida anywhere in Florida and you need your roof done holler at my brother Anthony BRSD roofing better roofing service delivery y'all check that out my wife customized it put the oratora stickers on it killer Let's get back to the image that we're going to be editing today. All right, guys, back to the two images that we're going to be engraving today. We got two pot Shakur and we got Biggie Smalls. All right, so only thing we really did to these uh, pictures, um, we, mir we mirrored the images. In my phone, I mirrored the images and uh, I turned them 90 degrees to the left. Um, as you see, we have two pictures here, and we got a, a gap in between them. You got to make sure to measure the radius and the di diameter of whatever you're going to be engraving on to make sure it fits. If you're not good with math, the only thing you got to do is set everything up, hit shift and frame on the item, and let it uh, put a mark on it, maybe a, a piece of uh, tape or a, a dot a white dot, black dot, whatever stands out to you. You can do all of this before you even paint it to make sure it's gonna work and make sure you have all your setting right. So you can start off putting a dot in, slow your speed down and put your images where you need them to be and hit shift and frame. As it turns, you'll see exactly where, where it's gonna start and where it's gonna end. Make sure it doesn't overlap. Um, this one right here is gonna have probably like a an inch gap in between on both sides of the picture. Um, like I said, if you don't wanna do math, that's the easy way to do it. So only thing we're gonna do to these images has already been done. We mirrored the pictures, we mirrored them, we sized them to the vase 205 width, 110 height. Mirrored them and turned them 90 degrees to the left because that's the way I got my roller set up. All right, and um, we're gonna go to cuts and layers. In our cuts on layers tab, we're gonna be doing 2600 speed and 65% power. 
um, line interval, interval gonna be 100 and DPI is gonna be 254. It's gonna be a Jarvis pass through, it's not gonna be selected. And we're gonna be doing one pass. Make sure you have your negative image on because we did paint it white then black, so we need to turn on negative Im image. And that's our settings. We're gonna go here, we're gonna click preview. Make sure you have invert and it'll show you how it's gonna look. So first it's gonna be doing Tupac Shakur, and then it's gonna be doing Biggie Smalls. Also, everything seems to be backwards. So I am gonna put a scan angle of 180 degrees because everything seems to be going backwards. I might have to spin my uh, rotary roller around but I'm just leaving like this for now. Um, and that's our setting. This is gonna be an amazing burn. When the paint dries, we're gonna start this burn. Y'all stick around. All right, guys, our vase is dry. Ready to start this thing. All the items that I use today will be in the description section. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna hit shift and frame to make sure we got everything lined up. And it's looking good. We're gonna start this thing. Y'all stick around. It's gonna be an amazing burn.